Hey everyone, a lot of you have been asking us to review an affordable RGB air cooler and today I have come up with one of the best budget RGB air cooler that we have covered in one of our previous videos. I have the Cooler Master Master Air MA610P which is designed for gamers and heavy users and will offer quite a decent performance at a moderate price. Anyways, let's get on with the review and see what comes inside the box. Techfluencer delivers a complete buying guide for tech enthusiasts. Here, we try our best to make you pick the best PC components, laptops, and other tech gadgets with brief technical information, pros and cons, ratings, and recommendations. Our tech expert team tests, reviews, and benchmarks thousands of products to come up with the list of the best and latest products, along with recommendations for the viewers. To know what is the best choice for you, watch the full video and check the description for the purchase links. So Master Air MA610P CPU air cooler comes in a securely packaged box. As you open the box, there is another box with all the necessary hardware for mounting on both Intel and AMD, as well as some other stuff which we will come back to in a bit. Underneath the box, there are installation guide, warranty information papers, and finally, the air cooler itself inside a secure styrofoam box so that it doesn't get damaged while in transport. As for the other box, you'll find an ample supply of mounting brackets and hardware inside. Cooler Master has also provided a small syringe of its Master Gel Pro Thermal Compound, an RGB Molex power adapter, and an RGB control module for those who may not have a motherboard with a 4-pin RGB connector. From the looks of it, the Cooler Master Master Air MA610P is a pretty well-sized cooler, measuring in at 116 by 60 by 158 millimeters, sporting dual master fan MF120R RGB fans in a pull-push configuration. The fans mount around the cooling tower by simply cleaning onto either side of the cooling fins. They can easily be taken off as they are required to install the cooler. Such a closed design does look pretty neat and unique, but it also means the fans are not easily replaceable and you can't go with different fans. However, since the fans will be working in a push-pull configuration, it will help dissipate heat faster. For RGB color control, each fan coupled to a central splitter within the cooling tower which also lights up the Cooler Master crest on the top cover. There are 6 heat pipes and the fins of the cooling tower and the heat pipes are left unpainted showing mutated sheen of aluminum and metallic contrast of bright copper. As a whole, this cooler looks great with the sturdy build quality. Now let's talk about how easy it is to install the air cooler. With universal retention brackets compatible with the latest Intel and AMD socket CPU, the Cooler Master Master Air MA610P is incredibly easy to mount and ensures hassle-free installation. However, it is a pretty big air cooler, so there is very little space that is left out. You can install two RAMs pretty easily, but you may not be able to install four high-profile RAMs. Although it is dependable on your choice of motherboard and RAM, you might get enough space to install 4 RAMs if they're not such a high profile. We have tried installing G-Skill Ribjaws RAM and was able to install 4 RAMs which left very little room. While trying to install G-Skill Trident RGB RAMs, we were only able to install 3 RAMs with no space for a fourth one. Anyways, I've installed this air cooler in two of my systems to give you some understanding of its capabilities. My first system is an Intel Core i9-9900K on MSI Z390 gaming motherboard with a total of 16GB of RAM and Zotac RTX 2070 mini GPU. While I had another AMD system with Ryzen 9 3900X on MSI X570 gaming motherboard with up to 24GB of RAM along with colorful GTX 1660 Ti. We ran a stress test with 8 A64 Extreme for 10 minutes on both systems and the result is as you can see on your screen. I would not say it performed the best, but it was able to hold down the fort providing decent cooling performance. Although the performance was slightly better on the Intel system than the AMD system. We have also tested the Cooler Master Master Air MA610P against Bikeski 360mm AIO cooler, a cheap liquid cooler on our Intel system and you see that the Cooler Master performed better compared to the AIO liquid cooler. So in terms of performance, the MA610P isn't the greatest performer and there are better solutions out there that will give you much better performance. However, it does offer decent performance and the RGB lighting looks pretty cool. 
When you connect the 4-pin RGB connector to your motherboard, you'll be able to sync the fan's RGB lighting to the lighting of your rig. This RGB air cooler looked particularly amazing as I have Cooler Master case and all the fans are also from Cooler Master. As a result, the lighting effects seem really cool in the dark. So with that, we are done with our review of Cooler Master Master Air MA610P. If you like this video, then hit like and share with your friends. Let us know your thoughts in the comment section below and consider subscribing to this channel for more videos like this. Press the bell icon to be notified for our future videos.